Happy International Women's Day again. Well, today we have a special guest. She is a friend for the past wow, 21 years or more. She's a TV host. She's a, a columnist. She's a, she was a radio a presenter, and she was doing all the MC, and she was also doing. I mean, she is still doing a lot of this, and also modeling. You know. Um, endorsement face she's the face of many many brands and yeah she is also the godmother to my daughter Lala who is she hmm Wong Choi Ling also known as Angel Wong I'm really happy that she can do this with me let's see what she will say shall we Hi, Chilling. How are you? Hi, Mel. How are you? I'm good. Question number one. What does mm. International Women's Day mean to you? Uh, International Women's Day means um, uh, a very good um, opportunity to remind everybody in this world that uh, women power is still here. And we, every year we can do much better. Uh, especially this year, it's just a challenge. Um, you know, under this um, the pandemic, I think we all need this, um, you know, the daring quality to uh, choose to challenge rather than to live in fear. Yeah, it makes us stronger, right? Mm hmm Okay. But we have to. <laughs> yeah, we have to. What kind of women inspired you? Uh, there are two figures. Um, number one is Oprah Winfrey. Uh, wow. I think because of um, the hosting, because um, she is a producer, she is a host. But the way she does her things is not only a show, okay? It becomes a network and it becomes part of uh, um, a, lot, a lot of people's life. Um, not only she is influential, she contributes a lot to the society, to the people around her. And uh, this I really, really admire. And I hope one day, you know, I can be as successful as Oprah Winfrey. Now, number two, definitely my mom. Uh, you know my mom right now. <laughs> she is the one who taught me and showed me how um, a good woman is like. Okay. Uh, in Chinese, we call it uh, meaning you're both good um, inside or outside. That's why, you know, I have a lot of interviews and the topics are uh, usually around how I juggle and how I balance between my business and family. I think this, I, you know, I learned from my mom. But my mom is a housewife. She manages the, fa the family as though she is running a company. Therefore, I think, you know, she does it very well. And uh, um, under her guidance, um, three of her three girls in, in the family, three, all of us are very happy and healthy as well as um i would say capable <laughs> relatively capable yeah all three hat trick <laughs> okay describe woman in one word magician oh i like that yeah. women 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 are a magician you know they juggle so many, <laughs> yeah okay they, they can juggle so many things at one time okay to be very honest uh, i think the multitasking ability for, of women is amazing. Okay, you, you go to talk to any guys uh, who claim that um, he can multitask very well. But you compare to the average, you know, the average women who can multitask, mm -hmm. there is a big difference. Yeah. yeah. So I think, you know, um, and th this is one part. The other, the other thing is, I think women, um, emotionally, they can take a lot. Yeah, emotional. You know, there are a lot of things that we probably don't like, mm -hmm. but we could we, we we can take it. We can take it, and uh, we I, would, I wouldn't say tolerate. Um, it's like we we would embrace a lot of things that we 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 disagree. Yeah. yeah. So this yeah, I think that, that's why I say it's magician, physical, emotional, mental, whatever it is. You know, we we can juggle well. We manage well. It's okay. You go do your own things. I will set to it within. Yeah, so yeah. right? Yeah. Yeah, exactly. All right. Uh then what mindset does society have for women? Well, it depends on culture and um practice, different practices, right? Uh equality. All right, next. How can men get more involved then? 
I think this um I think this MCO helped a lot <laughs> because um you know it used to be you see for for guy uh, it, it's quite straightforward you know they go to work and then they come home mm-hmm. uh for 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 career women like us you know we go to work we still have to come back to take care of everything all right uh because of the lockdown we are stuck we got nowhere to go i'm talking about the guys <laughs> so the guys would be able to see how much needs to be taken care at home and if they can share a part you know or some part, you know some part of work that that would help a lot yeah that would help a lot and if he can help me to take up some of the work at home i can do more and i can yeah. focus more yeah so i can i can generate or contribute more you know it's a cycle right all right next yeah. What is one piece of advice to all the women who are juggling between home and work, like what we are all doing? Okay, uh, don't be calculative, you know, look at the broad picture. Sit, wait. Being able to juggle and being able to contribute, to me, is a very, very big satisfaction. Yeah, I feel very satisfied. You see, being able to contribute, I was like, wow, you know, hey, hello, if I'm cal- calculative, why do I have to put effort you know in uh, in everything including you know finding money but okay. to, to me it's like being able to contribute you earn respect and being able to contribute meaning you are capable yeah. if you're not capable you can't even take care of yourself how can you contribute how can you how can you take care of everybody around you so to me i feel really satisfied when i contribute uh, to my family uh, to my company to the industry to the society so i look at it you know I look at a very big picture. Okay, one day I always I always tell myself if one day uh, I'm not in this world anymore, when my friends throw a farewell party to me, oh, I want yeah. yeah I want a lot of people to go on stage and hey I want to say something about Wong Chilling. I want to say something about Wong Chilling rather than um, anyone wants to say anything about Wong Chilling. Uh, 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 uh. <laughs> okay, name three things that make um, women strong. Three things that make women strong. Okay, I think number one is willpower. Yeah, you gotta have a very strong willpower, and then your belief. Yeah, mm-hmm. I have a special ability. You know, if I want that thing to happen, I will make it happen. Yeah, really? if you have strong belief, you know, you always think. Okay, let's say if you want something or you want to achieve something, you believe in yourself. Whatever you say, whatever you do, whatever you hear, it will move along the that angle that you want. So number one willpower, number two is belief, number three is sorry, very stupid. Can I say money? Yeah, why not? Money. Yeah, I think not that um, I'm so I'm not that I'm materialistic, but to be honest, um, a lot of people use money to you know as a measurement. Yeah. To me, it's a measurement of whether your ideas are great or not. In return. In return, like uh, what Jack Ma said, you know, I said, okay, it's a byproduct. Yeah, it's so-called a measurement to to um, um, to to see whether you know idea your ideas or your decision is mm-hmm. is is good or bad. Yeah. Okay. How do you manage life and work? Integration. Uh, a lot of people ask me, hey, how do I balance work, life, and family? They are all one thing to me. Yeah, they're all, it's, yeah, they're all the same, you know. I, I love what I do, so it's part of my life. I love my family, it's part of my life. And probably what's lacking for me is you don't see me having hobbies, right? I, I don't, yeah, because what, I'm, what I've been doing, like, like taking care of my family and then, uh, uh, you know, a lot of, to tackle a lot of challenges in, 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 in my business, I think that's part of life and, and it's very enjoyable. It's fun. <laughs> so that's my hobby. So hobby, like whatever. I just mix everything together. <laughs> to know. Anyway, yeah. what advice would you give to your younger self? My younger self? Don't be stupid. Oh, yeah, I was stupid when I was young. <laughs> really? I made, I made a lot of mistakes when I was young. Okay. But I, that's I, what I, we honestly, do, right? We learn from mistakes. Yeah, and don't think that you are too good to be true. Don't think you are too smart. So from there, I started from scratch. And then very, very down to earth uh, to acquire a new skill. And then uh, from, from really foundation, from, from the, the most basic 
thing uh, in this industry, I slowly learn and learn and learn and learn and learn until today. That was 24, five years ago. All yeah. right. Okay, next. What makes a strong woman like you? What makes a strong woman? Like I said, willpower. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. I know. You what has to have your willpower? Yeah, willpower. I think that's, that's very, very, very important. How do you see women in today's society? How do I see women in, in, the, in our society? Today? I think in Malaysia, um, women have improved a lot. They are more daring. And uh, a lot of people used to have some thoughts, but they would not uh, uh, execute. Uh, nowadays, I see a lot of women, you know, they think of something they want to do it, they feel like doing it, they really, really make the first step. Because um, uh, we always talk about, you know, um, our dreams, what, whatever we want to do, but without the first step, nothing, nothing would happen. Um, so these days, I see a lot of women, they are actually taking actions. Um, and I hope uh, for some of them uh, out there who are still hesitating, don't wait. Because the longer you wait, the less chance it would happen. Yep. Sometimes you're know, thinking too much or thinking too long. It's called procrastination. Hesitation equals nothing. Okay, ten ringgit, whether you're ten ringgit, uh, one million times zero equals zero. Yeah, it's great. It's a um, like I say, you uh, you're very good in you know uh, giving um, sort of kind of inspiring talk and 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 you are very good with your words i always admire you uh, no i think it's good you're very entrepreneur as well you know it, you are a good entrepreneur and thank you so much for taking thank time. you i believe that you know the more you share the more you learn okay every time exactly. you cannot do the same sharing all the time okay the more you share you unload or offload you need to reload only you can share again right so it actually helps us to you know to to learn to, to go further so thank you very much for um No, uh, I'm learning. Take care. Right, Bye. Thank you. Thanks. Bye. Bye.